Hello, I'm Rubber Spatula, and I gathered 18 of my favorite teapot failed debuters besides me, and we're going to put them all in a competition because why not? Competitions are always fun. Now everyone please form three teams of six. Lights, camera, sound, and action. I'll be directing this team. Oh, uh, oh, okay. Hey, Battery, want to join my team? You got it. I am sad that my friend Snowdrum is not here. Hey, I'll be your friend. Yeah, and I'll be your friend too. Yay, so many new friends. Well, I won't be your friend. So can I join your team? No. How about you guys? No. Fine, guess I'm stuck with the camera crew then. Hey, where did Salt Lamp go? Can the next person we pick for our team be colorful? We're kind of grayscale right now. No, let's stick to a theme. Only grayscale characters. Tax return document, get over here. Okay, but if I join, my friend PDA has to join too. Well, she's gray enough, I guess. Don't judge people for being colorful. You have the most colors in all of us combined. Hey, Leek, check out this backflip. <laughs> That's not a backflip. This is a backflip. Whoa, that was sick. You're on the team. Listen, I don't have a favorite letter. Ah, uh, well, nobody asked, but you want to join our team? Sure. I'd also love to join this team, and I'll bring this poor bug I found on its back. Well, looks like the three of us are with you guys. What? I was one of the last ones picked? Grr, I'm so mad, grr. Meh, <sighs> whatever. All right, so let's be called the directors. Uh, why do we have to be called what you want to be called? We're not even on the first challenge yet, and you're already being kind of bossy. What? Yeah, we want freedom, so let's be called freedom. Ah, uh, but you guys aren't dumb. You're stupid, so let's be called free stupid. <laughs> even though I don't have a favorite letter or color, I think we should be called J. <laughs> and make that logo yellow. I just think it fits better. Hmm. <laughs> Conch Shell seems to be in deep thought. Probably thinking of a really good name. We should use whatever she's thinking of. So, Conch Shell, what are you thinking of? Huh? Oh. Lithuania. <laughs> well, I never revealed this to you guys because you started picking team names before I even told you to. But the first challenge was actually to pick team names. Whoever has the worst team name is up for elimination. And personally, Jay, I don't think your team name was very creative, so you're up for elimination. Viewers. Vote for which member of J you want to be eliminated. Voting ends when I feel like there's enough votes and I don't want to count anymore. Hey everyone, uh, sorry, I'm a little tired today. I was up all night counting all the votes because I didn't expect we'd get so many. And I drunk four gallons of coffee and I think I can feel them coming up. Anyways, shopping cart, salt lamp and tape are all safe. Here, have some coffee. <coughs> Onigiri is safe. <coughs> what? I'm in the bottom two, but I don't have a favorite letter, color, or animal. And the person eliminated is... Fine! I admit it! I have a favorite letter! It's J! My favorite color is yellow! And my favorite animal is whale sharks! And my favorite food is onigiri! <gasps> Nineball is eliminated with over a hundred votes. So, Nineball... Any last words before you disappear into nothingness? <sighs> I don't have a lot of favorite things, but I do have a favorite show, MBM. The entire first season is already done and on the Yellow Emerald channel, and season 2 is still going. Episode 2 will be coming out very soon, so stay tuned and subscribe! Some people were sad that all of the failed debuters weren't in the season, so to make them happy, your next challenge is to find one of them. Back in my day, we couldn't find people very easily because there wasn't much technology. Yeah, but in my day, I can just build a robot version of Scissors and win the challenge. Lithuania is safe. So, do I get to compete in the season? <laughs> Why'd you do that? What? I don't want him to actually debut and lower my chances. Let's use this microphone to announce to them that they need to come over here and help us. Hey, Tsunami Season, come over here and help us, please! I'm not that kind of microphone, you idiot! Are you guys forgetting that we have a PDA on our team? We can just call one of them. But I don't have any of their numbers. Well, I do. I got Disky's number once. What was it? Well, I took a picture of it. It should be behind my back. There's nothing on this. Oh, I don't think I had it developed. Hey, Rubber Spatula, we got Nonexisty inside of Shopping Cart. Oh, cool. So Jay is safe, and Free Stupid is up for elimination. Viewers, vote for the member of Free Stupid you want to be eliminated. Whoever gets the most votes will be eliminated next episode. Welcome back. Free Stupid is up for elimination and we got 415 votes. Boom Mike, PDA, and Camera are all safe. Oh, thank goodness. I thought the viewers would vote me out for forgetting to have arms last episode. 
Clapboard is safe, and it's down to kitchen sink and income tax return document. Oh, I just know I'm out. I'm afraid you're correct. You are out. Aw, oh, man. Wait, which one of us? You, income tax return document. Oh, I'm still in. Let's go. You'll pay for this rubber spatula. Okay, should I pay with cash or card? Ugh, bye everyone. Your next challenge is to tell a story, but each person on your team only gets to say one sentence. Go. Uh, there was once a man. And this was a very strong man. He was also a very handsome man. He was also a very manly man. And that man was me. The end. Not really much of a story. Anyways, next. There was once a brother and a sister. And one day they had a disagreement. Because they hated each other. But one day the brother decided to apologize. He went up to his sister and he said, Huh? What are we doing? <laughs> what a weird ending. Anyways, next. I went to the store on Tuesday. And then I died. Wh and then I was at my funeral. And then they lowered me into the ground. And it was really sad. Okay, weird. But I still think Jay had the worst story. So they're up for elimination. Viewers, please don't vote for me just because you don't like the way I look, please. Yeah, viewers, vote for Tape. He's the one who ruined the story. Well, I ruined it. You're the one who started it, making it bad from the beginning. Vote for Shampoo. She's ugly. Vote him. Vote her. Vote her. Jesus, we all just be friends. Viewers, vote for the member of Jay you want to be eliminated. Whoever gets the most votes will be eliminated next episode. Welcome back. We got 497 votes. Shopping cart is safe with only 25 votes. Only 25 out of 497? Shopping cart, you are severely underhated. Just not many votes for me after they were all for you. Hey, Rubber Spatula still hasn't announced the votes yet. There's still a chance I could be safe. Tape is eliminated with over 200 votes. No suspense? Oh, come on! Your next challenge is murder, so you have to kill someone on the other team to win. Go! Killing? Now this is my type of challenge! Huh? What's going on? Whoa! Wonder how much this will sell for. Add to cart. Rubber Spatula, since Conch Shell died when they had Salt Lamp, are we safe? No, because nobody on your team killed Conch Shell, it was Blender. But Newton's third law says that when two objects interact, they apply forces to each other. That's why Conch Shell shattered, because Salt Lamp applied force to Conch Shell when they collided. So that means Salt Lamp technically killed Conch Shell, and that we should be safe. You're hurting my head, just stop it. Guess not then. Whoa, I didn't know that shampoo was smart. Oh no, please don't tell me what I think is happening is happening. You're the brains of the team, you can't be distracted! Yeah, I have to agree. I know you're in love, but we're competing for a prize that hasn't been specified yet. That's so cool. Yeah, you're a team leader. You have to stay focused. I can still love. Murder is wrong. Uh -oh. And letting people go hungry is wrong. It's called the circle of life. Viewers, you once again have to vote for the member of J you want eliminated. Whoever gets the most votes will be eliminated next episode. 565 votes this time. Shopping cart and Onigiri are safe. And the person eliminated is... Salt Lamp. Goodbye! Your next challenge is the BFB12 challenge, because I can't be bothered to be original. So I'll take the mind of somebody and put it into the body of somebody else on another team. Guess who the imposter is to win? If you get it wrong twice, you lose! Go! Well, I know I'm me. Onigiri is dead, so shopping cart. Wow, I didn't even get a chance. Well, it was pretty obvious. Jay is safe. So, uh... I'm Battery. I could tell. Hey, Shampoo, uh, you, would you be interested in going out sometime? Oh, sorry, Battery, but I'm kind of into taller guys. <laughs> no! We guess avocado. That is incorrect. If you get it wrong one more time, you lose. Hey, what was that for? I was just clearing out a possibility. Hmm, well, Kitchen Sink hasn't said anything annoying yet, so him? Wrong. Get it wrong one more time and you lose. I can't believe you would accuse me like that, public display of affection. My name stands for Personal Digital Assistant. Well, nice going. That was a really dumb idea. Whoa, you're usually a lot more calm than this, Avocado. Well, I have trouble staying calm when somebody does something stupid. As Avocado's friend, he is acting kind of out of character right now. You guys, you already guessed me and Rubber Spatula said you were wrong. There's no way it can be me. We accuse Avocado again! 
I don't know why you thought it was a good idea to accuse the same person twice, but to no one's surprise, wrong. You're up for elimination. Ha! You just got clapped! Get it? Because I'm a clapboard? Viewers, vote for the member of Lithuania you want to eliminate. Whoever gets the most votes will be eliminated next episode. Hello everyone, and welcome to episode 6 of What If The Teapot Debuters Were In The Season. We got 606 votes. Battery, VHS, and League are all safe. I swear, if I get eliminated for being the voice of reason, then I'm gonna- Will the next one safe, Avocado? Oh. I guess I'll save that for later then. And now it's down to Conch Shell and Blender. Can you recover Conch Shell? Okay. Jippily hip, snippily dip. Conch Shell, I wish you were alive and well. Huh? What's going on? Blender is eliminated. What? I'm eliminated? Grr! I'm mad! Grr! Gurgle! 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 And now that you're all still here, you can now go and make me a sandwich! Which is your next challenge. Go! Okay, Battery, our team leader, what should we do? I don't know. Make a sandwich. That's the challenge, I guess. Shampoo rejected him. Uh. Oh no, he's sad. How is he supposed to lead the team if he's depressed? Here, this is the sandwich making machine that Battery made four years ago to replace his ex wife. Making sandwich? Ugh! Ah! There you go. Here you are, rubber spatula. Why, thank you. Lithuania is safe. Shopping cart? Shopping cart, where are you? Ah, rubber spatula, can you please recover Onigiri? But Onigiri isn't dead. What? Ah, uh, fine. There's your stupid teammate back. How did you not digest her? Kitchen sinks don't have digestive systems, silly. Is no one gonna comment on the fact that there's two of me? Yeah, why is there two of me? Oh, we never did finish the last challenge, so there is still an imposter lying around. Rubber Spatula, we guess that clapboard is the fake. I don't know which clapboard you're talking about, but I'm going to assume it's the wrong one. So get it wrong one more time and you lose! What? But that's not even the challenge! I'm so confused. I don't know what's real anymore. Am I real? Am I the imposter? Nope, wrong. Your team is up for elimination. What? That wasn't even the challenge! Viewers, vote for the member of Free Stupid you want to eliminate. Whoever receives the most votes will be going bye-bye next episode. 625 votes this time. PDA and camera are safe. So are one of the clapboards, boom mic, and kitchen sink. So here's the deal. Clapboard, you're the third one safe, but at the same time you got the most votes and should be eliminated. So I don't really know what to do. Well, why'd you make there be two different voting options? I thought it would be funny. But since there was only supposed to be five voting options, I'll just move all the F votes to E. So Boom Mike is eliminated. I don't think that's very fair, but I did cost my team the challenge, so sorry everyone. Okay, I'm giving up this act thing. I'm actually shopping cart. Sorry, I'll go back to my team. Your next challenge is to eat British food. B -b 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 British food? Oh please, it can't be that bad. <laughs> Luckily, sinks don't have taste buds. Ow. Free Stupid is safe. I always like trying new foods from different cultures, so I'm not afraid of this food. <laughs> Rubber Spatula, can you recover? Wait! Oh. Getting a dead person to eat it? Now that's clever. Jay is safe. So Lithuania is, hey, where is Lithuania? In Europe? No, I mean, where's the team, Lithuania? Man, I'm so glad we could go on this family vacation. Yes, it's so nice here. Yeah, it's alright. Are you feeling better, Battery? I don't know. Going on a vacation isn't just gonna magically make me feel better. But you need to be fit to lead the team. Be better! Be better! Hey, shouldn't we be getting back for the next challenge soon? No, nah, the next challenge isn't gonna be for a while. We got plenty of time and- <gasps> What? There's a random cut on my arm, how did I get this? Lithuania, you missed the challenge and you're up for elimination. Oh yeah, that's right, I carved clock hands into my arm to make as a makeshift watch. I don't think it worked though. Viewers, vote for the member of Lithuania you want to eliminate. Whoever receives the most votes is going goo doo 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 next episode. Goo doo doo doo, what the heck is that, what is wrong with me? We got 542 votes this time. That's the first time it ever went down. <laughs> Avocado, Battery, and Leak are all safe. And last person safe is VHS. So, Conch Shell. Huh? You've been eliminated. Oh, th that's alright, I don't really care. Hey Battery, are you starting to get over shampoo yet? Yeah, I'm starting to realize maybe being sad isn't really worth it. Well, I'm proud of you, buddy. 
Yeah, Shampoo just has really high standards. I bet if I went over there and asked her out, she would reject me too. Watch. Hey Shampoo, would you like to go out sometime? Oh, of course I would. You're so tall. Uh. Ooh. Your next challenge is to make me laugh. Go. Hey Rubber Spatula, I farted. Oh, now that's funny. Free stupid is safe. I hate this show. I can't believe she rejects me and takes him just because he's taller. I'm still attractive despite my height, right? <laughs> oh, that was a good one, Battery! Lithuania is safe, which means Jay is up for elimination. Dang it, Onigiri. We should have just acted on impulse instead of trying to think of actually funny jokes. How foolish we were to think that we would actually have to try. He laughs at anything. I bet he'd even laugh if I said the word apple. <laughs> funny, but the challenge is already over, Jay. Nice try, though. Viewers, vote for the member of Jay you want to eliminate. Whoever gets the most votes will go poof next episode. 766 votes this time. It went back up again. Shopping cart, for the fourth time in a row, you're the first one safe on your team. And shampoo, this is the fourth time in a row you are in the bottom two of your team. Feel like today is the day you finally get eliminated? Now, why would the viewers want to vote me off after seeing how cute me and Leek are together? Well, you're eliminated. Oh. No, we barely got to spend any time together. That sucks. I hope you win. <laughs> that was the weirdest kiss I've ever seen. Is it bad that I've seen weirder? You've all worked so hard to get to the final ten, so I thought I'll let you all just relax. No challenge for today. Oh yeah, now I can just sit back, relax, and stay in one spot, like I always am. Take five, everyone. Dang, Leek. Must suck that shampoo got out. Now it's your turn to be depressed. I know I'll see her again after the competition, so I'm not gonna cry. Life is always moving, man, so you gotta move with it or you'll get left behind. That is some really good advice. No wonder Shampoo took Leek over you, Battery. He's just better in every way. What about my intelligence? Remember all the challenges I carried this team through with my inventions? Uh, I'm gonna do something amazing! So you'll all like me better than Leek. Just watch! Tsuri, you were supposed to relax, no challenge, and you're going out there to work and make the world a better place? No, you were supposed to relax, your team is up for elimination. Viewers, vote for the member of Lithuania who you want to eliminate. Whoever gets the most votes will end up gone and forgotten, like how I forgot to take my schizophrenia pills. Oh hey, what's up Shadow the Hedgehog? Isn't it nice how every single episode starts with my face? Anyways, we got 823 votes. Avocado and battery are safe. And the person going home is... VHS, with a record 446 votes. What? Back in my day, we respected our elders. We didn't gang up against them and vote them up. Today's challenge is Simon Says. Now, Simon Says, stand on one foot. Camera and shopping cart are out. Well, this is just fantastic. Now stand on two feet. Mm, two feet. Oh, PDA is out. What? Why? Because he didn't say Simon Says. What? Haven't you played Simon Says before? No. What? 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 Everyone's played Simon Says. I mean, I always played Director Says, which is my version of it, but I still know Simon Says. I can't believe you've never played Simon Says. Anyways, Simon Says not to be an emotional wreck. And battery is out. Oh, you just love picking on me, don't you? Can't stand on one foot much longer. Oh, and clapboard is out. Kitchen sink is the best. Yeah, I know I am. Looks like kitchen sink is out. Wait, what? I didn't say Simon says kitchen sink is the best, but I didn't even perform an action. Yes, but you believed me. So you're up for elimination. Oh, come on. Viewers, voting will be done very differently from now on. Click the first link in the description to go to a Google form, and vote on that instead of the comments. See you next episode! Okay, so here's how this is going to work. Whoever got the least votes to be saved, and whoever got the most votes to be eliminated, are in danger. 
Then, I'll take the votes they got to be saved and subtract it by the votes they got to be eliminated. And whoever ends up with the least votes is out. Out of 1,200 votes, Camera got the least votes to be saved and Kitchen Sink got the most votes to be eliminated. And subtracting their elimination votes from their save votes, Camera is eliminated. This is embarrassing. Hide me. Consider yourself hidden. Anyways, guys, I gotta go do something real quick. Be right back. Hello, eliminated contestants. Yay! Rubber spatula got out! Uh, no. You guys have been in the back rooms for a while, so I decided it's finally time for the viewers to vote one of you to rejoin. The viewers better vote for me so that I can come back and make you pay. No! The viewers better vote for me so that I can come back and do more wicked stunts. The viewers actually should vote for me so that I can see Leak again. Enough talking! This is supposed to be a short episode. Viewers, click the link in the description to vote for who you want to return. Whoever receives the most votes will no clip back into reality. Hello everyone! So we had a vote to rejoin, and Shampoo won! So Shampoo, welcome back! <gasps> it's my Shampoo Poo baby! Leaky, I missed you! Ah, uh, make it stop! I agree, I don't want to look at this anymore. Congratulations everyone, you've all made it to the merge! Yay! Oh, yeah! Your next challenge is to stare at the sun. The first five people that stop staring at the sun lose. Staring at the sun is not good for your eyes. Yeah, we're not doing that. Your loss. Ow! I can't do it anymore. You're just weak. <laughs> I feel no pain. Ow! I can't do this anymore. Ah, me neither. All right, we have a five losers. You can all stop staring at the sun now. Oh, thank goodness. Yeah, thank goodness indeed. Onigiri, you can stop staring at the sun. Onigiri? Onigiri? Hello? Onigiri, can you hear me? Onigiri! Hello! Onigiri! Viewers, click the first link in the description and vote for the person you want to save and the person you want to eliminate. To make up for this whole rejoin business, two people will be going home next episode, so make sure you vote for who you want to save and who you want to go home. See you all next episode! <laughs> Since today is a double elimination, whoever received the most votes to be eliminated and whoever received the least votes to be saved will both be eliminated. In the vote to save department, shopping cart and shampoo are both safe. So our clapboard and PDA. So Leek is out. No, Leek! It's alright, Shampoo. Win for me, okay? I will. I'm sorry, Shampoo, but you can't because you got the most votes to be eliminated, so you're also out. Yeah! At least they'll be going out together. What's going on? I can't see anything. Goodbye, Leek and Shampoo. Weren't there going to be messages that the audience wrote for us? Oh, yeah, but we mostly got responses like this, so we're never doing that again. <laughs> Anyways, your next challenge is a dance challenge. Whoever does the best dance wins. I'm so happy about Leek and Shampoo getting out that I'm going to do a celebratory dance. <laughs> Oh, Battery, I'm not even going to give anyone else a chance. You win. Everyone else is up for elimination. Glad you're finally over Shampoo, Battery. Yeah, I don't need love anyway. Love is cringe. Hey, Onigiri, did you know that the mitochondria is the powerhouse of the cell? Whoa, I didn't know Shopping Cart was smart. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Viewers, click the link in the description and then vote for who you want to save and who you want to eliminate. Whoever is, y y you know the drill. <sighs> I'm sad. Why? Because only 59% of people said I was a good host. Rubber spatula, that's over half. I don't think you should be sad about that. But what about the other 41%? <laughs> Anyways, in the vote to save department, Clapboard got the least votes. And on the vote to eliminate side, Kitchen Sink got the most votes, only having six more than PDA, the closest voting we've ever had. And subtracting Clapboard and Kitchen Sink's vote to save votes by their elimination votes, Kitchen Sink ends up with significantly less, so Kitchen Sink is eliminated. I knew this would happen. Since the day I decided to be a mean character, I knew children would ravage at me until I was gone. But you know what? I'm saying it today. I am a mean character, and I'm proud! Well, for a mean character, 7th place isn't bad. Good job, Kitchen Sink. Anyways, back to crying. <laughs> Your challenge is to make me feel better. Hey, shopping cart, would you like to go out sometime? Uh, no. What? Why are you trying to get with every girl here? 
Yeah, Battery, with all of the girls here, for each of them your compatibility percent is less than four. Whoa, Avocado. I didn't know you were... smart. No! Don't worry, I'm also a director in therapy. Battery, why do you seek validation through relationships? Uh, I don't. Yes, you do. Come on, just tell me why. Fine. My ex-wife told me that I was a horrible person, and that I'd never be able to get with a woman ever again. I guess a little part of me believed her, and I've been trying to prove her and myself wrong ever since. Battery, what she said doesn't define you. Love yourself. It doesn't matter what she says and thinks about you. Also, you're always making, like, inventions and stuff. You're the smartest one here, and you love smart people, don't you? Yeah, I am smart. Mm, mm, come here, battery. Mm, mm. That is disgusting. Also, Clapboard, I'm taking your words into account, and I'm going to believe that I'm a good host, even if a bunch of people said that I wasn't. Thank you. You win the challenge. Yeah! Viewers, vote for who you want to save and who you want to eliminate through the link in the description. Welcome to the second to last episode. Out of 1,273 votes, BDA got the least to be saved, and Onigiri got the most to be eliminated. But since I find both of you equally as boring, I'm just going to eliminate both of you. What? Wait, can you fix my eyes first, please? Your next challenge is to escape the moon. But we're not on the moon, what? All right, Avocado, help me build this rocket surfboard for us to escape. You got it. <laughs> Are you trying to jump off the moon? I'm not even gonna try, because I already know I'm not getting voted off. I'm like a fan favorite. All right, Avocado, it's finished. So let's just get on and- Sorry, but only one of us can win. You know what, that is fair. Only one of us could escape the moon. Avocado successfully escaped the moon. So she is safe and battery, clapboard and shopping cart are all up for elimination. Viewers, vote for who you want to save and who you want to eliminate in the link in the description. You also will have to vote for who you want to win since next episode is the finale. Anyways, see you in the finale! Welcome to the finale of What If The Teapot Debuters Were In A Season. Shopping cart, you got the least votes to be saved and the most votes to be eliminated, so you're out. Good, I wanted this to happen. That's why I acted all cocky last episode. Why? Because I saw what the prize was and it's totally lame and I want to go hang out with everybody else in the back room, so bye. Okay, on to the winner. Avocado, with only 275 votes, you don't win. Oh, what the heck? Now, battery and clapboard. One of you got 437 votes, the other got 680 votes. And the winner is... Battery! What's my prize? A Cheeto Puff! Wow. Go ahead, eat it! Why did it have the consistency of an apple? Viewers, thank you so much for watching this silly little series. If you want more of stuff like this, with even funnier jokes, writing that is actually good, and, you know, not just a minute long, then you should totally watch MBM. The entire reason this series was created was to advertise MBM, so you might as well go watch it if you like this one. Bye!